Hi, welcome to another Hikeholics video. In this video, we will show you how to seam seal your tent. We will take you through the process step by step. Seam sealing is a crucial step in preparing your tent for outdoor adventures, as it ensures that your tent remains waterproof and it provides a comfortable shelter from the elements. So why do you need to seam seal? Seam sealing is essential because even if the fabric of your tent is waterproof, the stitching and seams can allow water to seep through. By seam sealing your tent, you can ensure that your tent remains watertight and prevents moisture from seeping through the stitching. What do you need to seam seal your tent? To seam seal your tent, the first thing you need is space. Space to set your tent up and allow it to dry properly. You can do this outside like we do, as long as the weather is good and the tent is not in direct sunlight. You will need a seam sealer, which comes with a small brush. Seam sealers come in different types and brands, so make sure to choose one that is compatible with the fabric of your tent. You may also need a cloth to wipe off any excess sealer. We just use paper towel. And additionally, we use white spirit or benzene. Although it is not necessary, we do this because of mixing the sealer with white spirit makes it more liquid. And because of this, the sealer can effectively seep into the seams, resulting in a neater outcome. Now onto the most important part, how to seam seal. The first step, Grab your seam sealer and we just use like a plastic cup, put it all in there. Then grab the benzene and mix it 50-50. And then just have something you can stir it with and stir it well. After you stir it well, it should look a little bit like this. So the next step is to apply this mix to the stitching. Make sure to do it all the way from the top to the bottom, like so. Works very easy. Just go over all the stitching. Make sure to also apply the seam sealer on the sides of the zippers. Just make sure you get every spot very well. After you apply it to the stitching, wipe off any excess sealer with the cloth or with the paper towel. And basically do this for hold the tent. There's one exception we'll show you. You don't need to seam seal the bottom stitching because if water seeps through here, it will just hit the floor and it will save you seam sealer, of course. 24 hours later. Here you can see how the seam sealer has dried up. There are a few less tidy areas, but best to be safe than sorry. As you can see, seam sealing is pretty easy. It just takes some time. We just let it dry for 24 hours. The drying time for most seam sealers is at least four hours, but it's best to follow the specific instructions that's provided by the manufacturer. After seam sealing your tent, you should avoid packing it until the sealer is fully dry. And it's best to keep your tent set up while it is drying, as this will allow the sealer to dry evenly and prevent any excess sealer from dripping onto other areas of the tent. If you are unable to keep your tent set up like us, you can hang it up or even lay it flat on a clean and dry surface. Just make sure that the area you choose is well ventilated and away from direct sunlight or heat sources. To put it to the ultimate test, subject the tent to a water hose to verify if there are any water leaks. Does every tent need seam sealing? Not all tents need seam sealing, but it's recommended to seam seal any tent that is not already factory sealed or that has been used extensively. If you notice water seeping through the seams of your tent, it's a sign that you need to seam seal it. Additionally, if you are camping in any wet or rainy conditions, 
it's a good idea to seam seal your tent to ensure that you stay dry and comfortable. If you're unsure whether your tent needs seam sealing or not, check the manufacturer's recommendations or contact them directly for any advice. So seam sealing is a simple process that can be done at home and ensures that your tent is ready for any adventure. It's important to take care of your gear so it can take care of you. We hope that this video has been informative and helpful to you. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask us. Thanks for watching and enjoy your next dry camping adventure.